Welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy. Last time we did the rest of. We did the entirety of. Almost the entirety of Clockwork Wor Ruins Galaxy and the rest of Melty Monster. Melty Monster is the one that took us the longest, frankly. Since when? Game is doing a really bad job at alerting us when things happen. Uh, but regardless, we have a chance. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm super, not super far ahead, but I don't feel burnt out as I was in, um, art, uh, Thousand Year Door-ish. Super Paper Mario and like other games I've played on my channel so far. Yes. Unless out of it for the entirety of this let's play. So this has been one of my best let's plays so far. Far I've been like constantly talking. Well, mostly. There's been sections where I've been not talking, but that's because I've been needing to focus. Are you ready to take on the great game player Chimps Galaxy again? Score 10,000 points. Get something right and you might get a, you get a star. Good luck. Ow. They're doing super poorly here. Cheese and crackers. Cheese and crackers! Fuck off. God damn it. Oh, we are so close. Hey, at least we got this done first try. And we are going to do nothing. Good day, sir. We are not falling off the edge this time. Amazing, you got some more points than me. Here, take the star! You've earned it! Oh, I'm so glad this is the most fresh try of asking. <sighs> Not a great galaxy to do stuff like that. Buffy Black kinda got away with it, you know, it's pretty open, but like that is not open. Another one! <sighs> well, I guess no rest for the weary. This is another- Oh no, this is a daredevil run. Good thing we did the entire fight without getting hit. <laughs> is this daredevil speed? Yeah, this is daredevil run. Actually, I remember. 
the stage is actually different. For once. It's, it's still... You know... Still short, but there is some difference. There's an entire extra planet. Or a change planet. 18 lives, jeez. There's an entire extra planet and a moving platform we have to aim for. Here's the gimmick Poison is an insta kill. Granted, it would be an insta-kill if it's a damage, any hazard, but this rotates back and forth. Also, one of the few stages with a checkpoint. Very handy. Oh, like an extra life we don't need. Also, one of the few times we have actually seen the poison pit. Like, it really does not show up. It's the same, like, if you manage to get out of it before you die, you still live. Dude, you don't have a grand star, you have a regular star. What are you talking about? Yeah, there's also not a lot of, uh, price of common missions in the check well, it makes sense. They're supposed to be hard modes. But see unique gimmicks. Phase two. Damn you. Final phase! Actually, what's the position of the fire bars that might in phase three, in phase three, aside from like the moving, it might actually be easier. Maybe we also have to, we do have to take into account he does move. Again, really easy. We're so far ahead of course in our, in like Star Town. It's not even At least it's better than you actually want where the last half of the start of the game were locked behind the new game uh, beating the game. Granted we still have to redo Fight the final boss twice. Still, for some reason, like attack. Like I'm being serious. We need to refight. Uh, do the final stage again to unlock green stars. All right. 
I have no idea why. It seems inefficient. Alright, Clockwork Ruins. I do not like this stage. Wham! Wham! Adventures of the Purple Coins. Hey! At least we get this cool nighttime aesthetic. Five minutes. Deflect. All 100 purple coins. So easier said than done. There is no room to be missing some, and some can be pretty darn hidden. At least again, we get the best song in the game. I really like the song that they use for the purple coins. Yeah. Also, I think this is just Gusty Gardens. This is just Gusty Gardens. Yeah, th I like you. I think I've said this in the original. Well, because the original also had stuff like that. But I like I like people tell that stuff that like tells you, oh, do you have it this much? Then go back. It limits the area you have to research. We're gonna have to do another rotation, goddammit. Why? I mean, we're gonna we were gonna have to do another rotation anyway. But why? Our precious time limit. Our double precious time limit because we have two different time limits. One on the episode as a whole, and two on the stage. Double time limit. Got enough! Janky gravity. Two minutes. We left all the coins here. Okay. Okay. 
That was a close one. That could have ended poorly. Like. We should have almost 73, and we should have over that. Have it. Three more. Oh, thank you, Arceus. Quick and easy. I I'm I don't utterly hate purple coins, despite what it may seem. Like I I find them annoying, yeah, but I don't hate them. Contrary to popular belief. We almost have enough for the Hungry Luma. Fifty-five. I can't be enough to beat the game. At this point, let's throw it. Throwback Galaxy. I gotta be honest, my, all of my experience with Super Mario 64 is Super Mario 64 DS. I have never. I have played a bit of the original. I've watched quite a few videos on the original. But I haven't really played much of it. If that makes sense. But welcome to Swamp Bat, Bat Galaxy. I mean, Thought Bat Galaxy. Probably one of the stages with the highest shooting spawn, star spawn count. And also, literally one planet in the entire game. So we're turning up purple bomb bombs. But yeah, this is just, this is just a throwback. To, uh... I don't mind stuff like this. It may not be a game, 64 may not be a game I grew up with, but it's definitely a game I recognize to be pretty darn good. I and I did something that I have beaten uh, 64 Diaz. Maybe not 100%, but I have beat a, beaten that. Yeah, this is just, this is just Swamp uh, Throwback. There's multiple ways it can go, and hell, there's even a uh, Silver Star mission, which is kind of equivalent to Red Coins. Got to slot back to not have a fucking Red Coin mission. <laughs> but it gives you an excuse to like explore the explore around the place. After they changed the stairs from squares to cubes. Uh, from cubes to rectangles. Due to there no longer being a uh this wants being different than this game. It's like Swans has like two different designs throughout the entirety of of the Mario series. We have like the modern design that, you know, is sometimes spiky, sometimes not. Sometimes they have to stand on, sometimes not, and then we have the always safe to stand on the cube, the uh, the uh, of the rectangular ones. And like, yeah, there's just been like two designs for Swamp throughout the entirety of the series. I think it even the Asters end up another design.
we're gonna we're not gonna do start two this episode. Um, but there is it's just it's me, I guess. We're we're just gonna explore this as much as we can now. Because like this one's this is one fortress. Mario Galaxy Five. Uh, I don't know if you don't remember, Sizzler. I just think there is a red uh, coin star. Because I don't think the things spawn in red coin locations. One up at the top of the cycle. That, that fun factor is that you one up up there. I believe it's a chasing one up. Hey, Snatch Man. Also, we get to play as Luigi. I I just I just it's like Luigi wasn't in the original game, uh, original uh, Super Mario 64. He was technically meant to be, but he was never actually added. Pseudo not Swamp King. That we can't just ground pound through his uh, face because ground fun back in 64. Four ground pounds and ignore glit collision about with our ceilings. So yeah, only four, four detection counts for ground pound. Oh, so hello, Swamp King. Ah, you make me so mad. We build your houses, your castles, we pave your roads, and you still walk all over us. Do you, do, do, did you ever say thank you? No! Well, we're not going to... You're not gonna wipe your feet on me! I'll crush you just for fun. You have a problem with that? Just try ground pounding the walking hound. Yeah, he's a little bit bigger. Also remember, crushing is still an insta-kill. So I don't get why. Okay, maybe. The, yeah, there's many swamps. I guess. Three. One more hit. No, crushed again. I'm just a stepping stone after all. I won't grovel. Gravel, or gra grovel. Okay, you win. You're taking this with you. Dang it. Luigi committed regicide. All right. Oh, we have uh, another addition to the uh, horde. I think we did like three stars this episode. <laughs> Starship Mario can now advance. Ew! What are you doing bringing hazardous materials aboard? Here to make sure he stays calm. I don't want an angry bomb on this ship. We'll go see what that bomb bomb has to say. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Luigi. Yeah, but we'll have to see what that bomb bomb has to say before we end off the episode. <laughs> have you heard of the mystical le of this mystical legendary world? It sounds ama like an amazing place, but I wonder how you get there. Hmm, I wonder. Well, that's 
a later me problem. So, until next time, I'm gonna go upstairs before I get to recording. So yeah, I'll see you guys later.